Hello, this is Glenda with Fraylins and Friends Crafts Plus. I'm going to surprise you today. We're going back in time. I'm going to make something with beads. I'm going to try a little charm bracelet style. It's not really a charm bracelet, but it's a charm bracelet style. The fun th thing is to enjoy the little dangly things. I'm back with my glasses. Hello! Now maybe I can see what I'm doing. Now, let's see, which is the longest of all these? There used to be longest ones. These look all to be about the same. So we'll just pick one. And if it's not all the same, well, we can always twist the bracelet around. <laughs> now, I'm going to try and just center this one. Just because I want to. I don't know that it makes a whole lot of difference, but because I want to. There we go. I wonder if any of you recognize these little thingamabobs. They are what we hung across our backdrop last year around Christmas time. We took them down and I cut them off the string and now they have a new purpose. There we go. We've got a dangly. And, well, they're both dangly, but we've got a, what do you call that? Teardrop and a heart and a very shaky person. Okay. <laughs> now I'm going to guesstimate the distance. Uh, let's just go for the other heart. Why not? It's not the same shape, but hmm. It still means love, or like, or mostly love. Now you may ask, how in the world would you ever add another charm? Well, the answer to that is, you wouldn't. <laughs> Not you want it, not unless you wanted to completely undo this one. Come on. There. I think. Nope. I keep pulling it back out. <laughs> I'm wondering if I'm spacing these too much. You want them spaced, but I don't know about too much. Goodbye. Ah, I need a crochet hook or something. Go hook through there. Got it! I'm so proud of myself. Okay. Now I need another teardrop on each side. I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me Meant to be in the great outdoors, forever free. So 
Sometimes you need to go And take a step back To see the truth around you From a distance you can tell I'm not going to let anybody measure the distance between these charms because basically it's for fun and I don't care. There we go. Now I'm going to tie the two ends together in a tight knot. Really, really tight knot. Well, let's see how it fits around the rest first. Oh, yeah. That's going to have a lot of dangly to it. So, get a little closer here. But if I made it too tight, they wouldn't be able to clack against each other. Now, would they? We're just having fun today. Let's see how this thing looks on my wrist. Yeah, I'll speak a little bit of improper English. There, that's fun right there. We can let that thing just go wherever we want. But in case you didn't see before, that is so fun. <laughs> and yes, it would fall off my hand if I let it. So I don't know how long it'll last, but it's fun while it does last. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoyed my bits of fun. And back to the beads for at least for at least for now. So until next time. That ain't working. <laughs> I wonder about putting it around the bow of my glasses and around the back of my head. I don't think so. Do I look decorative like a gypsy? <laughs> or like one of those Bali dancers? I don't think I could do that. Anyway, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see you Friday. Another battery dead. In case there's still some on here, please do subscribe. Click that notification bell and give me a thumbs up. See you Friday. Love you. Good night.